This restaurant manager in northern Paris feels he's moving one step closer to normality. He's finally allowed to welcome guests inside and use his terrace at full instead of only half capacity. Normally, when it's raining, we can let our clients sit inside. During coronavirus restrictions, we had to turn them away. Now we can stay open until 11 p.m., which means we don't have to rush our clients. The restaurant's turnover plummeted by 65 percent over the past year, with a loss only partly made up for by government subsidies. The director hopes the café will soon be running at full speed again because travel restrictions are also easing. Many of our clients are tourists. That fills the gap left by our regulars who leave the area during the summer holidays. Without tourists, we won't have much business from mid-July on. Parisians are delighted to regain their freedom, but they also feel slightly wary. In here it's fresher, the sun outside is getting really hot. There's less dust and less noise, as outside there's quite a lot of traffic. I feel like I'm alive again and can take up my old habits. But I hope people will keep sticking to certain safety rules. This is a very lively area, especially at night. Theatres, cultural venues and shops are allowed to let in more customers. Gyms and sports clubs are reopening under certain conditions. More restrictions are to be lifted in the coming weeks, if Covid infection numbers allow for it. The government has put more than 200 billion euros on the table to get companies through the crisis. These emergency support measures will now gradually be phased out. The hope is that the third lockdown will have been the last one due to the COVID-19 pandemic.